Teaching children about homelessness can be a tough job, but teacher Jennifer Gray knows exactly how to do so this holiday season. She's introducing a project called Everybody Deserves a Smile. And although it's all coming together at Christmas time, these students have been working on it since November. It's a project where we take in donations from the community and the students hand paint bags and make homemade cards and then we give them to the less fortunate people in Port Alberni. We put um, cookies, toques, uh, mittens, toothbrush, toothpaste and scarves. The bags are filled with goodies, but as a teacher, Jennifer is asking for more than just donations from her students. She's asking for an understanding of what it means to be homeless. Miss Gray went to East Vancouver and handed out some of the supplies, and she took a video, so our older students are going to get a chance to take a look at that video and actually see some of the things that they've collected be given to, to people outside of Port Alberni, as well as we have some of our grade fours and fives that will be going to Bread of Life. Yeah. We've done a lot of work about what our life looks like, how we get to come home to a warm bed, a warm house, and have a meal. And then we talk about, how about if we didn't have money for these things? No matter what we're doing, no matter where we're living, no matter how we look, we are all somebody. And judging by the students we talked to at John Howitt, the message has definitely been understood. Say you don't have any Christmas gifts at Christmas, or you live on the side of the street, it'd be very helpful to get a nice bag of cookies and a tube and socks, stuff that you don't get usually. Because everybody can make a difference, you're making a difference every day, just by smiling and saying hello. This program has created an opportunity for these children to help some of those less fortunate this Christmas. Because everybody deserves a smile. In Port Alberni, I'm Rochelle Van Zoren.